Terry Hatcher is a famous person. She is seen here doing yoga, meditation. These are things that Christians should avoid. People that are living in the truth of Jesus, we do not need to enlighten ourselves. God will give us eyes to see when he has grace upon us, when we have faith in the finished work of Jesus Christ, our Lord, God, and Savior. Yoga, meditation, very popular nowadays. It leads to kundalini. It leads to third eye and chakras, raising your consciousness and vibration, getting Christ consciousness, not blasphemous at all. Terry Hatcher is keeping the vow of silence about the biblical world and about fame, fortune, and success. Has she taken a bite out of that apple? You know, like Adam and Eve in the beginning. The serpent Satan beguiles Eve. She eats of the apple. God says, please don't do this one thing. They did not listen to God. They listened to Satan, the father of lies, the originator of lies. God cannot lie. Adam Eve, Eve says, hey, let's do, let's do this together. Let's bla like blaspheme and not listen to God together. They listen to Satan. And in our world, Apple is a very, very, very popular company. Phones and computers, etc. Their logo is an apple with a bite out of it. You know, like in the garden, taking a bite out of the forbidden fruit. God says, please don't do this one thing. And they listen to Satan. The world listens to Satan. How much did the first Apple computer cost? $666. Nothing to research or look into here. What the heck, eh? And Terry Hatcher is also doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra. It's a gesture from yoga. You know, that's supposed to represent supreme enlightenment. This is false. It's lies from Satan. Just like in the beginning, there's nothing new under the sun. Brothers and sisters, God bless you.